<laughs> hey, welcome back to the channel. Smoke that is barbecue. You already know what time it is. You know what time it is. I'd like to thank everybody for like, comment, subscribing to my channel. If you're new to my channel, you're the first time watching, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell. For all my subscribers, make sure you hit that notification bell so every time I drop these, you know, five videos, you'll be able to catch them. Before we even get started though, go ahead and like the video. You know how I do it, I'm waiting on you. <clears throat> hey, go ahead and like the video, I'm waiting on you. You ready? You like the video. If you're sitting at home from your phone, like the video. Come on, comment real quick, say I'm here. I'm at the house watching you. If you watching it from your TV, go ahead and just hit the like button, boom. Watch it from your laptop. Give me a like in the comment. Tell me you're here. Yeah, we about to go in. Yeah, a little lighty pops. Lighty pops? Chicken lighty pops? You heard? That thumbnail look pretty good. Some Something simple and easy. Um, I'm going to do it on a new wave. Of course, I would do them on a the grill. Just comment down below if you'd like to see me do these on the grill. But I'm going to just do something quick and simple. Look. A little easy, something you could do at the house. It's a little working to it, cause making them lighter pops. It ain't easy. It ain't really fun, but I'm gonna try to make it easy for you though. So let's go ahead. Make sure everybody like it. Boom. You like it? You fresh out the shower? Okay, appreciate you. I hey, appreciate you for liking the video. Fresh out the shower? Okay. You got the kids? You put the kids to bed? Okay. You at work? Oh, what you got? Okay, appreciate, appreciate. It. So let's get ready to get started. We're gonna do some lighty pop chicken legs. So you know, basically you're just gonna watch this tutorial, like and comment as you go. And we're gonna get started. Hey. <laughs> let's get this party started. Freshly cleaned chicken legs, of course. I already did one off camera just to give you an example of what we got going. Make sure you got you a very sharp knife to get started. You got to have you a very, 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 very sharp knife. And all I do is keep it real simple. I'm just going. Take a nice little cut around. Nice sharp knife. And I'm gonna use my little tip part. That's it. It's a little process. Of course it did a lot easier off camera. So if I can just pull it out. Pull all this bad stuff out. If you can pull it out, pull it out. And cut all this off. That's a process, y'all. It's lighty pop chicken. And then just take these little extra little veins or whatever, hit it with a sharp knife. Of course, you're gonna take the chicken and wash it once you get finished. You can wash it and season it then. Same little procedure. Go about right here. All the way around. Matter of fact, let's try something different on this one. We're gonna try to cut it down. Split it. Oh, okay, that's, that's easier. Split that bone like that. That's some work, y'all, so I'm not going to bore you through the whole process of cleaning all these chicken legs, because as you can tell, this is some work. So, it's an easier technique. Somebody let me know. Let 
I'm like the pump chicken. So just repeat these steps. I got two did so done so far. We're gonna repeat these steps and keep it moving. Found an easier way. I changed up my knife. I got the pointed tip. So this right here works a lot easier. Just go around the whole chicken. And take that pointy part. Let's make it a lot easier. Knife so sharp you can just shave it off for real. That was a quick and easier way. Light and pop chicken. Alright, here we go. The last one. That bottom part well, that you don't eat no way. Get a good score around. I'm just going to shave it off, basically. Find an easier way, let me know. This is my easiest way. That was way faster and easier. Comment down below if you think that was way faster and easier with the pointed tip like this. Hey, this is my first time doing it, y'all, so don't, don't be too rough on me. <laughs> hey, this is my first time doing it, but hey, I got them all done. We're going to get them all I'm going to wash them all off again. We're going to get some season put on them. Lollipop chicken. That's why they call it a lollipop. Hold it like a lollipop. Let's, uh, let's, get, a, let's get a wash on them. Then we're going to get them seasoned. Then we're going to put them on a new wave. And make it do what it do. Stay tuned. Get started with some just simple ingredients, something simple you get from the neighborhood store. You know I love that. You know, they ain't never like a little marinade. A lot of folks like to use Dale seasonings, but each is on. I just go in there with a nice little, a little coat on it, you know. Nothing too crazy. You know, I gotta hit it with some of that good old. Yeah, I gotta put some of that on now. You already know. Some of that good Creole, Creole. Put a little seasoning in now. Then we're gonna put our hands in there and get it all mixed in. I'm gonna do a little garlic and herb. You know, just some neighborhood, simple, little easy recipe. But it will taste so good. A little flavor on that, that's all. You know, we're about to get in here with our hands and mix it up. Lightly pop chicken, man. Let them marinate. Let these marinate for about 15, 20 minutes. Hold on, I'm just gonna do a little 30 minute marinade. A little 30 minute marinade. You ain't gotta do nothing too, nothing too fancy. Just some nice seasoning on there. Pull your skin down. Get you one more seasoning. See all that seasoning on that meat. She put all that seasoning and flavor on that meat. I'm gonna pull my, see all that seasoning and flavor? And just gonna pull that skin back over it. And I'm gonna put a little bit more seasoning on it. And set them to the side. You can put as much seasoning as you would like. I just like, you know, put enough on there just to taste. I still want to be able to taste the chicken at the same time. I don't want it just to taste nothing but seasoning and flavor, you know? Comment down below how you like to taste your meat. You like to have your meat well seasoned to where you don't even taste the meat at all? And all you taste is straight season? And I got a better taste of the meat. Add a little nice little finishing razzle dazzle. Just 
add your little finishing rounds of dazzle, nothing too crazy. They look so good, I should put these on the grill. They look so good, I might have to change my mind and put these on the grill, y'all. You know what, I think I'm gonna have to throw these on the grill. No new wave, change the recipe. These gotta go on the grill, they look so good. I'm gonna let these marinate for about 30 minutes. That'll give me enough time to uh, get the grill nice and hot. That's just too much season and flavor for me to put it on the new wave. That deserves the grill. Look at them lighter pops. Nicely seasoned to perfection. Ooh. -woo. And I was gonna cook them on a new way, but I think they deserve to be on the smoker. Stay tuned and see which one I do. Will I do the new wave or will I do the smoker? New wave will be something quick and easy on the inside. The smoker will be on the outside a little bit more time consuming. Let's see which one I do. Yep, you guessed it. Putting them on the grill. Lighted pop chick is going on the grill. I couldn't resist it. I was gonna cook them on a new wave, and I was like, it's a pretty day. Let's put these things out here on the grill. We're gonna grill these. We ain't gonna smoke these today, y'all. We're gonna actually grill them. Oh, we nice beautiful day. Can't be this a nice beautiful day out today. Oh, you see all that seasoning flavor. All that seasoning flavor. Lighty pop chicken. They basically call it a lighted pop, as you can tell. You cut the little ends off, look at it, you hold it like a lighted pop. Nicely seasoned. Like I said, we're gonna just open fire those today. We're gonna cook them directly over the coals. We ain't gonna play no games. Stay tuned. Ooh, that thing's smoking good. We're about 15 minutes in. 15 minutes in. Yeah, don't, don't worry about what's over here because that's for somebody else. But yeah, we're about 15 minutes in. We're going to flip these guys. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're coming along just like I want them. Lollipop chicken, y'all. Lollipop chicken. You hear it sizzling? Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Lollipop chicken. Looking good already. Of course, you know what time it is. You know what time it is, y'all. You got the spray you need. Everybody ask me what's in my spray bottle, huh? You spray, you put whatever you want in your spray bottle. This spray you need real good. Yeah, that's a um, that's a beef London broil. So you can look that up, and if you would like to see that full recipe, I would do that as well. But this recipe is about these lighted pop chicken. Let me get in on y'all. All that season and flavor. Ooh, we. 
we'll come back out in about 15 more minutes and check it. Like so I'm cooking it right over the fire, so it's gonna cook. It's gonna be a quick cook. Oh, it's nice, low and slow. I said I wasn't gonna smoke them, I was gonna grill them. But it kind of turned into like a little smoke session. You know, using one of them old school barrel grills, you know, the fire is kind of low. So it's taking a little longer to cook. But I ain't in no rush. Look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that. Ooh, wee. That's some flavor on oh, no. there. And we're gonna let these go for about, so this is about 45 minutes in. So we'll let them go for about two hours, probably total. Cause I'm gonna leave the top open and I'm just gonna let them cook. Just let it grill now. Ooh, <laughs> I am so ready to dive in. I am so ready to dive in. Give you a little sneak peek of that. But yes, 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 yes. About an hour, 20 minutes in. I said we go for about probably a whole two hours, maybe a little longer. But do you see? The seasoning flavor on that chicken. Comment down below if you see the seasoning flavor on this chicken. We're almost done, y'all. We almost done. Try not to make the video too long, but I just want to show y'all the progress. And of course, when you open the grill to check it, you don't want to keep it open too long. And make sure you spray it. This is what helps keep it tender, makes it extra tender. I'll spray it on the side. Oh, see. And we're gonna cook this pretty much like a steak. This is gonna be pretty much like a steak. So, if y'all want the full recipe for that, you gotta comment down below and let me know. Tell me that lighter pop chicken ain't looking good. Ooh, wee. Needless to say, it got dark on me. So I'm about three hours in. I'm about to pull these up. Take them inside, do a tender test. Knock on my neighbor door. Let, him, let two of my neighbors try them so they can comment on the video once I'm done. Yeah, you see a lollipop chicken. Seasoned to perfection. Ooh, ooh, tell me that don't look good. So we'll do a tender test. Oh, tender test. You know I gotta show y'all that. Ooh, you saw how I did that. Tender test. I'm going to take that one away. That's mine. Lonely pop chicken cooked to perfection. Nice and tender. You see it tender? Pull apart. Wow. I would like to thank everybody for like, subscribing, make sure you and comment to my channel. I got a little tongue tied, man. My mouth is water, and I apologize. <laughs> Do you see that? I'm gonna dive in. Look at that. That is perfect chicken. Mm. Wow. Amazing. Mm. With that being said, I get it right this time. Mm. That is so delicious. I'd like to thank everybody for like, comment, and subscribing to my channel. Make sure you tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend that Smoke Daddy is doing it again. Full recipe for lighter pop chicken. Make sure you like and comment and subscribe. 
hit the notification bell. Smoke Lady Barbecue signing out. I love you, family.